I've never missed a day of school. Kid, how do I look? Uh, great. <laughs> Who's the lucky guy? Dr. Watt! The chemistry teacher? Uh-huh. I don't know what it is about that guy, but every time I get a look at his bald head and manic eyes, I go all gooey inside. <laughs> okay, that's enough information. Thanks. <laughs> yeah, it's true. Love is blind. I sure hope so. Hey, kid, I need you to do me a favor. <laughs> Dr. Watts doesn't actually realize that we're going on a date yet. <laughs> but we are. <laughs> and I need to get ready. So, can you get me Ms. Phillips' perfume from the staff room? You know where that is, right? Oh, and I almost forgot. Some candy and some sedatives. And for the sedatives, don't buy them. Just look for them in the trash. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I can do that. Good. <sighs> <laughs> you dress like an ugly girl. scare me, you know. I'll still beat you even though I've had a skin flow. I really need a drink. I can use that. to nip your Hey, Edna, I got your stuff. Hey, Edna, you old bat, I got your stuff. Ha! Oh, whoa. How do I look? <laughs> Fantastic. <laughs> if I was 50 years older, I'd date you myself. Ah, thanks, kid. 
<laughs> Where's the perfume? Right here. <clears throat> oh, thanks. I needed that. I get so nervous before a date. Yeah, well, good luck, Edna. Hey, kid, wait! I need you to do me a favor. Another one? Yeah. What's in it for me? Ha! I won't spit in your food. Will you spit in Mr. Hattricks if I say yes? <laughs> for you, kid, I'll do worse than spit. OK. <laughs> what do you want? I want to go on a nice date with Dr. Watt. So go then. Have fun. Yeah. Well, you know what you kids are like. You see a beautiful couple out on a date, and you're bound to do anything to ruin it. You got a point. So listen, I need you to watch out for me and keep those disgusting kids away. I should teach lessons or something. Boring and pointless. You brought it on yourself, Buster. All right, kids. I'm in a crap mood today, so just shut up and get to work. All right. You're getting somewhere now. I guess you're not useless. Not too shabby, Hopkins. You have some real skill there, son. Ain't no stopping Jimmy Hopkins. You know. Can you help me, sir? Hey, Miss Phillips. Hey, Jimmy. So what really happened to Mr. Galloway? Where did he go? It's a sad story, but... Well, sometimes when grown-ups get upset, they respond in the wrong ways, and, well... Small problems get bigger, and that's really the thing about being an adult. Miss, I'm not five. 
My mom's been married five times, and I've been expelled from seven schools. <laughs> yeah. He's a drunk. Stupid man couldn't control himself. Damn him! I love him. But that wretched ogre Hattrick guilt tripped him into committing himself into the asylum to get dried out. If only someone could get in there and tell him to get out, I'll take care of him. Why don't you go? Because that loveless scumbag Hattrick told him not to let me in, said I was a bad influence. Don't you worry, miss. I'll get him out. Okay. Meet me near the asylum tonight. I'll be there. And Jimmy? Yes, Miss Phillips? It's Ms, not Miss. Oh, right. What's new? <laughs> You make me think. Jimmy, I'm glad you made it. Please hurry and try to talk some sense into him. I'll be waiting for him at the asylum gates. Don't worry, miss. Thank you so much. What are you doing? Let's be friends, but don't anger the Watcher.
last thing we need is some sort of watcher stampede again. I must be a better person. I must be a better person. I must be a better person. Oh, God! I am pathetic! Hey, Mr. Galloway. Go away! I don't want to have another group therapy session with those people. If I have to pretend to be someone's mother one more time, I'll... Oh. Hi, Jimmy. Uh, what on earth are you doing here? Ms. Phillips sent me. She's really worried about you. Come on, let's get out of here. Oh, uh, uh, what? <laughs> I can't right now, Jimmy. I'm late for my regression therapy as it is. It's fantastic. I've discovered I really do hate myself. Patrick was right. I am a loser. No, you're not. Don't be ridiculous. Come on, we can't let bullies like Mr. Hattrick win. Okay, Jimmy. Jimmy, I really appreciate this. Thank you. Me too. I am so happy to have my galley bear back. Galley bear? And I think you'll be able to help me, if you want. The loons all got out. Can you help me get them back? Struggle now. It's for your own good. I guess you know that is stupid, don't you? Mr. Galloway, should you really be doing that? Oh, Jimmy. No, I suppose not, but life is unfair. You promised Ms. Phillips. Oh, God. What kind of world do we live in where I get punished for a minor indiscretion and Hattrick gets away with taking bribes from his pupils? He does? Yes. He sells advanced copies of tests to the sons of his rich friends and nobody says a word. Wait, what rich friends? Well, Darby Harrington, for one. I can't believe he's selling tests. What if I got evidence of him doing this? <laughs> then I'd never need to drink again. All right, let me see what I can do. I hurt my hand stuck his head down the toilet. I'm sick of being stupid. Last time I saw her. <laughs> It just sucks at smoking. Do you 
have my cash? All right, I'll pay. You drive a hard bargain. Hey, thanks a lot, big guy. Thanks for the cash, hey. chaps. What's buzzing? I cry myself to sleep. I sure hope he shows up. I need to get my grade up. Don't worry, he'll be here soon, I'm sure. You guys looking for something? Yeah, did you bring the goods? Thanks, buddy. See you at midterm. Leave stuff lying around everywhere. Feels like I'll never get out. I'm gonna win a football game. <laughs> you know. He drinks on school grounds. Think of the children, Dr. Krabblesnitch. Drinking? I will terminate the employment contract of any staff member found corrupting children. Morality is the most important lesson we can teach the youth. Is that so? Then you might want to look at these. What's this? It's that fat, evil hypocrite selling test answers to rich kids. Fire them. What? You took pictures? And to think I trusted you, hat trick? You're fired. But I. 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 Bye bye, fatty. And as for you, Galloway, there better not be anything to that drinking business. Nice work, Jimmy. Hello? 
You boy, don't just stand there. Come and help. What do you want, sir? Why did you send for me? I sent for you? Oh, yes, I did. Look at that plant, boy. Magnificent, isn't it? A crapula maxima fortissima. A rare and precious Venus flytrap. Unfortunately, there is a boy at this school, Darby Harrington, who was given such a plant from his father. His father is not a nice man. Darby is not a nice boy. They keep that plant to belittle my collection. There are two sides to biology, boy. Life and death. Do I make myself clear? Very clear, sir. You want me to kill Darby Harrington? Yeah, I'll get right on that. Not the boy, boy! The plant, boy! Kill the plant! Oh, right. Those are some uh, weird oh shoes. I wish there was something I could do. My mom calls me. My dad calls me. <laughs> in for last. You're looking good, sugar.
making it in the real world. Hey, buddy! Looking sharp. Well, I'm going to work at my father's firm this summer. He's making you work? Catch you later. So I asked Mother, why can't I access my trust fund? Give up now, my shirt is getting dirty. You ignorant ick, get over here. I'm unleashing prep power on your ticket. You'll regret this. I'll put you in your place. You want to bury all the big man? Right? All right. Through with him, you'll see. God. How's it hanging? Stick it in your ear!
you know, I hate... He was wearing out... surprised when you asked me to have coffee with you. I never knew you were interested in chemistry. Oh, my dear doctor, I'm very passionate in my love of chemistry. It's all I can do Lay off the sweet the blue. in my kitchen. It seems a student has been leaving muffins in my classroom when I'm not there. Let Hopkins in here. Really do look but they're just awful. I mean, really bad. I, I wonder who it could be. I'm surprised to see day. you in a Why restaurant you, uh, like this. No, no, no. I mean, I, I don't know who it could be. <laughs> I mean, kids are so silly. I hate most of them, the obnoxious little brats. Damn noisy, please. Ah, the foolish and the infatuations of youth. Smash. I suppose my mastery of the fascinating subject of I chemistry could quite affect a young woman. Oh, yes, me too. I imagine they'd be constantly <laughs> thinking about your bald head. On your heart, hey, Edna, your you know I really Maybe love the food you cook. To your <laughs> um, yeah, uh, sounds like you've, uh, given it some thought. Oh, yes, I mean, no, I mean, it's obvious, isn't it? Hmm? Your coffee is getting cold. Yeah, what? you're a scientist. You should be able to Get help us eat right. Cold. Right? Drink it all. It's good stuff. Whoa. Feeling a little light headed. It must be the fumes from the lab. Yeah, that's probably it. Have some more coffee. I'm feeling not good. Oh, I better go. Gorgeous. It's about time I show you what I know about chemistry. <laughs> and a little biology. <laughs> done and done right. Doctorate is in psychology. 